guys in this recipe video you will learn how to prepare bacon wrapped stuffed pepper so really delicious easy to prepare and always a hit at every party only three ingredients are needed for this recipe and optional ingredients are garlic salt and paprika so all you need is bacon jalapeno peppers and mozzarella cheese you can also use cream cheese if you want so begin by washing uh, your jalapeno peppers set them aside and i'm using a little bit of garlic salt to season the cheese and for that smoky flavor some paprika but you can skip them also soak in 10 to 12 toothpicks in water so that they don't burn when we use them so shred the cheese or use already grated cheese and then season it with paprika and garlic salt Bacon already has some salt, so you don't need to add too much, just a little bit for that hint of flavor. Then slice the jalapeno peppers into two halves, scoop out the seeds, take them out with a knife or with a spoon. Just take, use these um, seeds, let them dry out and then you can make a powder out of them and that can be used as well. You can leave a few seeds in if you want for a little extra kick. So our peppers have been hollowed out we are just going to stuff in the cheese mixture now and if you don't want cheese you can also use some boiled mashed potato seasoned so I have stuffed these peppers I'm going to simply wrap a bacon around them so you can use one large piece of bacon cut it into halves use it for two peppers or if the peppers are small use it on cut it into three parts and then use it on them so simply wrapping it around using the toothpick to hold everything together so very simple nothing complicated and so easy to prepare you can prepare this beforehand and then just bake them once the guests are coming or once you are ready to go out so we have wrap the bacon around pepper and once all are ready put them on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper or aluminum foil and then bake them at 400 degree fahrenheit for 15 to 20 minutes once the bacon is nice crispy golden you know that it's done cheese will melt will be nice and golden oh so good so give this recipe a try let us know how it turns out for you and don't forget to subscribe to my channel et Indian for more exciting recipe ideas